Hey, what's up? It's Nick. Welcome to Beer Me Out. Uh, today we're on the road. We're actually in Ferndale, Michigan, Nine Mile and Woodward at One-Eyed Betty's. Um, now this is a hot beer spot that's been getting all kinds of talk online. Uh, tons of beers, lots of drafts, lots of bottles. I haven't been here yet, so I'm excited to check it out. So let's go see what they got. I'm here with Sam. Uh, she's a bartender here, right? Yeah. At One Eye Betty's. And she's going to help us with this extensive beer list. So tell me what we got. Um, well, the new ones that are on, uh, I've been taking a look at this Oma Gang BPA. Uh, one of my favorites. Obviously, the ABT 12. Um, you can't go wrong with that, especially at noon. Yeah. <laughs> um, it's 10% alcohol. It's one of my favorites. I've heard that's really good. This beer list is really concentrated on Michigan beers, which I think is one of the coolest things mm -hmm. about this place. And then, like over a hundred bottles. Oh god, too. I haven't even tried all of them. <laughs> I have not even come close to trying all of our mm -hmm. bottles. And you guys do flights? We do flights, a three or a six, and I highly suggest it. It's pretty cool. We can actually write your beer on there so you don't forget what it is that you're ordering. And if you don't know what you're doing, man, the best way to go is to come in and get a flight. All right, I think that's what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna figure out a flight and start there. All right, we got our flights, so we're gonna start trying some beers. Uh, this is Matilda by Goose Island. I've got some of these in bottles that age in the fridge, but I've been, um, I just haven't opened them. I've been trying to age them, so we'll try it on draft. That's good, it's a pretty complex beer. It's got like a little bit of hop, a little bit of caramel maybe. This is really tasty, I like this a lot. The Shorts Controversial. I can't say it correctly, but it tastes great. Uh, very, very happy. Oh, this is really good. I like it. Okay, next up, uh, we've got Starbird Stout from Arcadia Ale. Uh, this is an oatmeal stout, which generally I love oatmeal stout. So let's see how this is. Really good taste. Um, it's actually a little thin, though. Good, good flavor, but I've had better oatmeal stouts, I would say. I'm not sure if I would recommend this one. All right, next up we got uh, Amagang Brewery out of New York. This is their Belgian Pale Ale. Comes in at about 6%, so highly recommended. Little sour, don't love it. Pretty good looking menu here as well as all the beer. Um, so we got a cheese board, cheese and beer, always good, good together, so we'll start with this and we'll see if uh, you want anything else. All right, just have a little bit of cheese. This is the Founders Double Trouble. Uh, I have yet to have this, so here we go. Delicious. Much like everything Founders makes, very good beer. Even tastier with cheese. All right, next up, one of my favorite beers, Atwater Vanilla Java Porter. I'm yet to have it on draft though, so pretty excited about this. It's delicious. Um, a little creamier than in the bottle. Just great vanilla, like that vanilla taste is so good. Last one of the first flight here, St. Bernardus, their ABT 12. Um, it's a quadruple, 10%. I've had a lot of friends tell me about this beer that they really like it, so uh, we'll see if I do. Yeah, this is good. This is pretty smooth for 10%. Sam here is gonna tell us about this really important glass that I just got my Sam Adams Boston Lager in, so. The founders spent tens of thousands of dollars and months and months of research on creating the absolute perfect pint glass. Mm -hmm. um, there, there are five points to this perfect pint glass. Uh, Sam gave us a big rundown on this great glass for the Sam Adams, let's give it a try. Sam Adams Boston Lager. It's really hard to go wrong with it. It is a solid, solid beer. Um, and the glass is good. Like it kind of forms your face real well. Almost like throws the beer right down your throat. Which is <laughs> pretty cool. It's like a bong in a glass. All right, that's all I got from uh, One Eyed Betty's. I want to say thanks to Sam and the whole crew here. They were great. If you're into craft beer, whether it be bottle or draft or great food, I would definitely recommend One Eyed Betty's in Ferndale. It was a great time. Uh, until next time, I'm Nick saying drink good beer. <laughs>